Okay, then. Oh, super duper strength. Nice. Now I just need Snookums. Yep. Right. I'm on it. <gasps> there he is. Snookums. Come here, boy. Come on, buddy, please. Snookums. Come here, boy. Oh god, I'd like to do something to get him. Oh, once I would wish... I wish things would be simple. Oh. <laughs> it came back here. That's cool. Any more butterflies? Nope. Gotta wonder if someone purposely messed with that shampoo. Yeah, too many things are going wrong for this wedding. Something is definitely awry. Oh. Good news, Walter. Snookums is right down the street. Really? That's awesome. But why didn't you pick him up? Well, every time I try, he runs the other way. I need to lure him out somehow. Huh. Well, Snookums is very particular. I know we won't eat any of the dog treats we carry here. Okay, I I'll figure out something. Don't worry, he's too scared to leave his hiding spot. So I have to get him some snacks. Okay. We haven't gone that side. Let's go into that side. What's there? The subway? I don't think we need the subway right now. Why? Any more butterflies? Nope. This is a pet shop. Pet shops have treats. Right? Woohoo! I think that was the last butterfly left in this neighborhood. Cool. Yay! Hey Hello. Cassie, you haven't found any wedding rings around here, have you? No, but I heard about that. Quinn must be a wreck. Yeah, it's not just the rings. It's the poodle, the cake, the flowers, the butterflies. Maybe someone's trying to ruin the wedding. Nah, who would do that? Mm. I don't know. Who knows? Could be Miss Big's ex-boyfriend, Colin. You know, that guy who's always on his cell phone? He came in for some bird seed yesterday, and I overheard him saying that he really needed someone to talk to. Anyway, let me know if I can help somehow. Do you have any dog Thanks. treats? Maybe I'll just look around your shop a little. Yeah, yeah, there are dog treats. Those treats look yummy. Oh, I'm tempted to try one myself. I bake them fresh every morning. Would Snookums go for one of those? Oh, totally. Except he only likes peanut butter poodle pops, and I'm sold out of those. Expected. Oh, I hate to ask, but do you think you could bake another one? No, she won't. Well, I would, but I still have all these packages to finish before the wedding. See? I'll pack them up for you. I'll do anything for a fresh baked peanut butter poodle pop. Can I, please? Okay, but it's not as easy as it looks. Oh, God. It's not easy. Okay. We need to place these items into the box. All of the items must be packed and none of them can overlap each other. Okay. Oh. 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 Oh, I did it. <laughs> wow. Oh, this is the first one, isn't it? The trick is to always do the big ones first. Yep, I think I did it. You, oh no, I didn't do it. One, two, then you come down. Oh, this is so bad. Here. 
you go here? Yes, I think. Who gives all these things? Okay, I think maybe nope. This will go here. Yes. Yeah. Hmm. I know other people must really think what they are doing mm, but I I don't think I can think All yes. right, I'm done. Perfect timing. This peanut butter poodle pop just turned a lovely golden brown. Here we go. Yes. Oh, she said something. <sighs> I'm sorry. Who are you? Ooh, on Ethel. Beautiful necklaces. Oh, aren't they dazzling? They've been selling like hotcakes. Everyone's buying something special to wear to the wedding? That's right. I'm looking for beads to replace the ones that fell off Miss Big's wedding gown. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot oh. about that. Well, I know she used Sparklovsky crystal beads. Mm. I have one. Oh, that's perfect. I hate to ask, but could you cut it so I can use the loose beads? Of course. Don't feel bad. Oh dear, where are my wire cutters? They're going. Oh. I'll just take the necklace then. I can find something to cut it. No, oh, no, it won't work. I use super strength feeding wire, and the only thing that cuts through it is my super strength wire cutters. Of course. Hey, I had them at the pet spa yesterday. I was doing some feeding while my parrot got her feathers fluffed. Okay, I'll go see if I can find them there. And these bottles are really bothering me, so I'm going to collect them. I'm sure they'll be used for something. Because their colors are... They don't match the background. See? See? Mm, where were we going? Oh yeah, to get Snickles. Snookums, look what I have for you! A peanut butter poodle pop! Oh, it's so cute! I'm not gonna hurt you! <gasps> oh my god! 
gotcha. He didn't get his treats. Clean it. Okay, Walter, get ready to be my new best friend for life. Second best, right? No way, Flo! Oh, Snookums! I've never been so happy to see your fluffy little face. Now let's see if this does the trick. Whoa, that's powerful stuff. My hands are back to normal too. Flo, you rock! I'll bring Snookums down to the cruise ship myself right after his fur dries a little more. Okay, see you at the wedding. Snookums looks fabulous! Miss Big will be thrilled! Thank you. Thank goodness for peanut butter poodle pops. They're pretty tasty, you know. What? Uh, never mind. I'll keep working on the list. I can't get over how perfectly white his fur looks. He's had a day of luxury at the pet spa. I guess he's ready to be the ring bearer then. Do you have the rings? Oh. No, no. Uh, I'm uh, keeping them in a safe place until it's time. Perfect. Yep. Hmm. We have to find some pliers. Oh, she left it at the spa. Hey, Walter. Did Ethel leave her wire cutters in here? Not that I know of, but she was in here today waiting for me to finish waxing her turtle. She has a parrot and a turtle? Maybe she left them lying around somewhere. Hmm. Bubble bath looks so relaxing. It's not a bubble bath. Sorry, Flo. It's for pets only. Yeah. Aha. There's always hidden treasures beneath sofa cushions. These must be Aunt Ethel's wire cutters. Oh, I got it. Cool. Under the sofa cushion at the pet spa. Fantastic! I'll cut that necklace for you right now. Thank you. You should say start saying thank you. You never say thank you. You're a lifesaver, on Ethel. How much do I owe you? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, nothing. It's on me. Okay. Well, next time you're at the diner, I'll treat you to your favorite banana berry pancakes. It's a deal. See you at the wedding. You're not gonna cry at the wedding again, are you? I'll try my best not to make a scene. Bye now. Oh, it's okay. Even I cry during weddings. Of family members, not random people. Now let's go make the dress. But who has the rings? Fifty thousand dollars worth of rings. Take. I should use these in the bead machine. Oh, I have to do it. Oh, great. Oh, now they are not even telling me a starting point. <laughs> oh, they have. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope this is right. Otherwise, I'll have to come all the way back. Nope, I'm right.
I don't think this is right. Oh. Still not right. How do I know where to start? This is bad. I'm sure this is wrong. Yep. This can't be right. How is this right? Oh, yeah, right. Sorry. You just have to add on the train, and that's it? The train? Oh no! The train! I completely forgot! I don't have any lace left! Where are we going to find more lace? We need a huge piece! Um, you keep on sewing. I'll go find lace. A great big piece of lace. No problem. How come you started- See you later, Bobby! Only five hours before the wedding. How is your bride okay with it? Oh, okay, you didn't actually make the dress, you're just bleeding. I think there were lace here. Yeah, see? Oh my god. Hey, Betty, mm -hmm. this is a long shot, but do you have any large pieces of white lace? Hmm. Well, sometimes I use lace for interior decorating. You know, a little lace can really dress up a window. Yeah. So I need it. Have those lace curtains? No way! Oh please! Come on, you owe me, right? I hear lace curtains are out of style anyway. Really? Well, in that case, fine. If you can find a way to get them down, be my guest. Hmm. I can't reach the curtain rod. What? You can. Let's see. You can try this again. Betty, do you have a long pole or something I can use to get the curtain rod down? No, and don't even think about standing on a chair. 
I'm not gonna have anybody falling down in my salon and suing me. Okay, I'll go look somewhere else for a long pole or something. Um, where do I go? You know what, Bunny? Why don't you go? I'll tell you it's here, and then you go. Okay? Bobby, sorry. I can't believe we ran out of lace. What a nightmare! I can't believe we ran out of. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Bobby. Any chance I could borrow that garment pole? Actually, I may need it to fix up those clothes displays later. I want my shop to look good for all the wedding guests in town. What if I did the displays? Everybody cares only about themselves except for you, Flo. Okay, but you have no idea how particular I am when it comes to these things. <sighs> Rearrange the displays so that every item is a different type and color than the items next to it. Above it and below it. Shirts can't go next to other shirts, pa pants can't go next to other pants, red items can't go next to red items and so on. Oh my god. Okay. So, one pan down, one up, one down. Oh, wow. Oh god. Okay. So, one skirt and one skirt. But red, red cannot be together. Yes. Mm. Oh. This is okay. Oh. Oh, no. Um, mm. This is stupid. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's get a hint. Okay. And then Try placing the blue shirt above the green pants. Okay. Okay. Yes. Oh god, this is a very stupid game. Oh god, no. Um, mm, let's do like that. Down. Down and up. Okay. Then you have... Hint. Yes. 
Yes. Pants up, pants down, pants up, pants down. Now you have to see with the color. Hmm. I need a hint. Oh. Those displays look perfect, Flo. Feel free to take that garment pool if you still need it. I'm sure I can use this somewhere. See you Let's later, go. Bobby. And I'm sorry, I got a little bunny. I'm just going to steal your curtain. What do you think, Bobby? Will these do the trick? I found them at the hair salon. Those are perfect, Flo. I'll sew it right on. Wow, I've never seen so many ruffles. Miss Big is gonna love it. She I really better looks love it. Nice. You're a lifesaver, Flo. I'll go bring the gown down to the cruise ship now. It really does look nice. See? It has all these three layers and you did a good job. We completed the neighborhood. Okay, we have to get the cake. Oh, only the cake. And butterflies. Ah. Uh. Wow, your gown is gorgeous. I can't believe how uh, flawless it looks. Every hmm? bead is just right. You're going to be a beautiful bride. Hey, of course she is. My Vicky Poo always looks beautiful. Tony, you're not supposed to be here. It's bad luck. Okay, okay. I'll be waiting for you at the end of the aisle, my sweet. I can't believe him. <laughs> Don't worry. Your wedding will go off without a hitch. I need to take the subway to the bakery now. I'll have to get